Hey everybody, this is Alpha Zero Forum Reviews at your service. I'm going to do a review on the new episode of Roku Joma no Shinru Kasa and other cases like the six six mat room in invaders or something. Now I'll let you know like um I was supposed to do a live reaction for it today, but you know like something bad happened to me, like something bad happened like um this morning for me and it, and I don't wanna talk about it right now because right now it's really starting to hurt me mentally and honestly when I looked at this and besides all that yeah maybe I'll make it up to you guys next week because right now something I'm just like really worried about something right now you know and other things so if anything else I'll let you this episode another another great one maybe not another great one but in other cases maybe a little boring one if I looked at it critically but at a certain point in my audience eyes I think it's way in other words, it's it's better than the other episodes. Well, better than the last one, you know. Even though it had a major, even though it had some improvements. So, if anything else, let's just get started. Okay, we have at the beginning we have Satomi like I'm um, asking all the girls to in the room to help to help him out to like um, write a story to write a story for a play, you know. But before any of that story happened, there was one scene about like Tulip like um talking to like um to her assistant Ruth about like um, a story she's reading and so forth so back to the part where Satomi wants to like um, have a story or a script for a play and so far like um the only one so far like um, he says you can help out I'll give you guys points or something you know that kind of thing which is not a bad deal you know but no one's gonna leave that room anyway which is like pre preposterous you know that kind of thing so if anything else, I gotta say like um this episode was alright, but it's all about like um preparing a play and story script, you know. What well, it, it is kind of a little boring, but it is way better than uh, the beginning episodes because honestly, when I looked at those um of course like um you if you all can't stay with me for this Roku Joma no Shinukasa um series review, then you know how much I've been like criticizing and ranting on this and shitting on the series already you know but this episode seemed to be okay but it's a little boring I won't I won't lie about that but it was pretty interesting how like uh, many people are helping out in this play that Tulip just made you know so it's like the blue knight or something I just go like ah uh, yeah whatever you know that kind of that kind of crap what's you know and so far like on um, the princess is Sakuraba Sakuraba senpai or something you know that kind of thing so I gotta say, like, um, this episode was alright, you know, but in my eyes it was kind of boring. But, you know, like, um, it is way better than, the, I'll be honest with you, way better episode than any other episodes that has been nothing but trying to, like, um, seduct the damn audience, you know, which really, really ticks me off. But, you know, like, um, yeah. So I gotta say this episode was um, about, like, preparing things, but the only thing what bothered me, or should I say what catches my attention is about Space Quake in this episode, you know? But the space quake was not much of a threat that Ruth says. And then at the ending right there, that girl she might be part of that space quake, you know. And later on says like, um, you're not going to ha have this happily ever after, whatever crap whatsoever, you know. And she seems to be saying that to Tulip that's not even watching or hearing, you know. So pretty much this is going to be, um, let me see here, um, pretty interesting in the next episode. Because I think I expect to see something, some kind of twist, you know. I like the other episodes is nothing more than a waste of trying to kill time or something, you know? But yeah. So I gotta say this episode's okay, you know, um it's about it. I'm sorry if I did not do a live reaction for it. It's because like um something bad happened to me like um today this morning and I don't wanna talk about it and right now like I'm worried of sick right now, so if anything else, like um I'm off of zero people, I'll see you on my next video today, okay? Later, peace out, bye. But um, before I go, uh, there's one thing I forgot to mention, like, um, Sakuraba only is able to act like him um, greatly when Satomi is around, so he's pretty much the Blue Knight, forgot to mention that. Sorry for saying that a couple minutes ago, so if anything else, I'll see you on my next video, alright? Bye, peace out, bye.